I know the human being and fish can coexist peacefully. That makes up for the people I've killed, right? Oh, they already lost me. Just hop the wall. Sweep the area. Drone, begin a search. There we go. Lined up perfectly. Alright, fine. Oh, that's right, I gotta hold it. Have you ever been arrested? What if I just got a whole cast of Albion dudes to, like, join me? Your teammate has sought out new accommodations in an Albion holding cell. Have London rents really gotten that bad? What an idiot. Come on, let's finish the job then.
stay here. I'll be back. I can't get off you. I still cannot get off you. Okay. All right. I mean, I already had it, but whatever. Easy, easy, easy. I'm dead set. You called us. Of course. You shouldn't have come here. I don't know for sure. I betrayed them. I just saved you, you knob. No, you've just damned us both. Look, um, I'll upload the intelligence onto an anonymous FTP. They'll explain everything. Actually, how about you explain everything? My name is Richard Malik. I'm an intelligence analyst. I believe Zero Day are rogue SIRS officers who framed you for the bombings to seize power. Oh. Now they're murdering or blackmailing anyone who threatens them, which now somehow includes me. Fine. Bagley will check out the info. But I better not regret this. That I can't promise. Oh. Oh. Malik has made his way out, and now I suggest you do the same. My magic carpet has arrived. WikiLeaks shit. Let's check the intel right away. All right, one second. Bags, see if this checks out. Then get everyone together for a debrief. I just kind of assumed it would be there. I don't know for sure. Espionage 101. Espionage. Nah, nah, nah. I've been fucked enough times to know what a print looks like. Oh. And I'm saying we should walk away, all right? Don't know about that. He needs our help. May I present the third option? Just use him. An SIRS whistleblower, even one you don't trust, could still help us find the arsehole that blew up half of London and framed DedSec for it. You don't have to invite him to your birthday, just use his information. Get cool. All Ooh. right, yeah. Okay. I'm here. Are you ready to begin? Here's the gist. Malice Intelligence checks out. A rogue okay. faction of SRS officers framed DedSec for the bombings to consolidate power over the government. But now they've noticed that some people are standing up to the new order, and they're blaming you. I believe these are the people you call Zero Day. I don't know their names, but it's safe to assume they have a ringleader. And in my experience overseas, removing the leader... Right. Kill the Queen and the whole Zero Day hive dies. Why now, though? Two weeks ago, a shell company connected with Zero Day's operations imported 40 kilos of Semtex from an old Soviet Ooh. block depot. But it never left London. Which means Zero Day is planning a bombing that will make those earlier bombings look like a bonfire. And I think I know why. 
As we're all now painfully aware, false flag attacks are a common propaganda tool for despots. Kill a load of people and the rest fall into line behind whoever says they won't let it happen again. In this case, Zero Day. Uh -huh. Which means we both want to discover who's pulling Zero Day strings. That beer is not in her hand. We need to get hold of the personnel dossiers of anyone connected with the earlier bombings and their cover-up. Then Malak and I can analyze their common connections and work out who's in charge of Zero Day. And I'll be on the comm to observe. That beer is still not in her hand. So if Malik's right, Zero Day are some kind of shadowy cabal of spies who blew up half the city to secretly take control of the government. But now they're pissed off that someone's standing up to them, so they're going to do it again. That's awful. I agree. You think they'd come up with something besides another bombing? Bit of a double beat, isn't it? Is it true? Zero Day's trying again just because we stood up to them. That's taking negative reinforcements to the next level, isn't it? Cut that victim blaming shit. I'd rather get blown up a thousand times than lie down just so some wannabe tyrants can stamp on my face. Okay. 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 What? What? Sabine, what? What? Don't really need a fast travel here, but whatever. Okay, that was not me. I'm here. You're stealing Sir's personnel dossiers. The organization is strictly compartmentalized, so they aren't stored in one central location. About time we spied on the spies. So what's the plan? Sirs uses a supercomputer called Filament to process information drawn from the CTOS network. It's like Noodle, if you could use it to search every document on every civilian, government, or commercial device everywhere in the United Kingdom. Instantly. Fucking hell. You can be horrified if you want, but it saved thousands of lives. Get access to a filament terminal and I'll provide you with the search terms. Welcome to Man vs. Car, where... A man fights a regular old car. Danger. Vehicle in critical condition. Please exit immediately.
moving to investigate. Jesus, is that what you're normally up against? Uh, yes. Sorry, what was the point of this? So there's no point in getting in there. Interesting enough. If I just get far enough away. Who? What? Huh? Okay. All right. Sure. Cool. Thank you guys for watching the video. Please rate, comment, like, uh, do all that uh, because it shows me that you liked it and it also shows YouTube that you liked it. Thank you guys for watching.